Nominal GDP? What is it, and why does it matter to the economy? Nominal GDP, the value of all goods and services produced in the economy during one year, can be an interesting statistic to follow when it comes to economic growth. It's often used as a measure of whether an economy is growing or shrinking, but this number can be difficult to interpret if you don't understand what it actually represents. In this video we'll talk about nominal GDP and its place in measuring economic growth. Gross domestic product, GDP, measures a country's total economic output for a certain time period. Nominal GDP, on the other hand, measures a country's total economic output in current prices, that means that inflation has been accounted for. The most common way of calculating nominal GDP is by adding up all of the income generated by goods and services produced within one year. What are some reasons why we should be interested in how much nominal GDP our country produces? Nominal GDP can tell us how well an economy is doing, whether it's growing, stagnating or shrinking. In addition, since nominal GDP includes the effects of inflation, it can also tell us if an economy has deflation or inflation. There are three components of nominal GDP, consumption expenditures by households on goods or services, government expenditure on goods and services, net investment by businesses, thus the amount spent on capital investments such as new equipment. The sum of these three components equals nominal gross domestic product. Nominal GDP is what matters when discussing economic policy because it reflects changes in production over time. When the nominal GDP grows, that means more goods and services have been produced by a country's citizens. Typically, this leads to higher wages for workers as well as lower unemployment rates. However, if it is flat or decreasing, then that likely means there's less production from the country's citizens which can lead to decreased wages for workers along with increased unemployment rates. For more explainer videos, subscribe to InvestorWeb.